Hi, hello, welcome to Positivity with Crochet. In this video, I'm going to show you how to crochet a simple mobile pouch. To make this simple phone pouch, the materials needed are you need two colors of yarn. I have taken light and the dark purple color. You can use any one color as well but I would like to use two colors and you need also a crochet hook I have taken 3.5 mm hook and also you need a pair of scissors let's begin with the slip knot insert the hook and now let's make 16 chains so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven sorry eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen and sixteen i have got sixteen chains now you can check the width of your phone by keeping it like this and if you feel that you need more chains you can add up as many chains as you need after this work three more chains now so one two and three so now from the fourth chain okay we will exclude the three chains that we have made just now and from the fourth chain that is here here we will work double crochet so to double crochet yarn over go inside here and pull through and we've got three loops now so yarn over and pull through first two loops and yarn over and pull through the next two loops so let's move on to the next chain here We'll repeat the same. Yes. So we will repeat this throughout these chains, and I'll get back once I reach here. Yes, now I have reached till the end here. I have made these many double crochets. So I'll be working on the last chain here. You can see here. So here all together I need to work. Three double crochets in the last chain so pull through so one double crochet I've done I need two more double crochets in the same space so I have done with two double crochets and I need one more double crochet in the same space so yarn over pull through two pull through two so I have done with three double crochets you can see here one two and three so now I'll be working on the other side here so I'll be working inside this space so throughout the row I'll be working one double crochet inside these many spaces chains so work double crochet one double crochet throughout this row and I'll get back once I reach here till the end now I have reached till here now this is the last round this is the last chain so here I need to work three double crochets because we have worked here three double crochets so here as well we have to work three double crochet in the space so one double crochet in the same space we'll be working two more so two double crochet and three so after three double crochet we will slip stitch on top of these three chains we have made so here on top of the third chain 
we will slip stitch and we'll join the round so by the end we have got like this so now I will be working on the next round so work three chains that is one two and three after chaining three we will work here in the space we will work double crochet so double crochet two loops pull through two loops so now we will work throughout the round so we will work throughout the round one double crochet and i'll get back once i reach here now i have reached till the end here so when you do like this it will start to curl up like this and now we will slip stitch these are the three chains that we have made so we will slip stitch on top of the third chain like this so slip stitch like this now we will be working on the next round so work three chains one two and three and we will repeat this after chaining three we will work double crochet like this so one and go to the next chain and work one more double crochet like this and we will repeat this throughout the round and you can see here now it starts forming like this so now we will repeat this throughout the round now I have reached till the end here so now I would like to change the color of my yarn so grab your the next color if you do not want to change the color you can continue with the same yarn but I would look I would like to change the color of my yarn so now we have done till here so on top of the third chain insert the hook and now you grab your The next color that you would like to change and pull through and you will pull through the next loop now take the previous yarn and hold it tight grab the yarn hold it pull it tight and yes so we have joined like this now after joining this we will work three chains so one two and three so now you can cut off this yarn that is the previous yarn you can cut it like this leave little bit and so cut it like this and yes as I said we have worked three chains and after this again repeat the same so work on one double crochet in the next stitch and again work one more double crochet here and repeat the same throughout the round so i would like to have three more layers of this color so one two three again i'll be using the dark purple for next three more rows so repeat that throughout the round and i'll get back after three rows are done now i have reached till the end here end of this so i have made three rows of this color so now now i would like to change the color of my yarn so what I need to do is you we, I need to grab the next color in my hand I need to have that so now on top of the third chain here I would like to change the color of my yarn so grab this yarn pull through and you will pull through the next loop and now hold the previous yarn and 
pull it tight so pull it tight and now the pull the present yarn and you will pull through pull it tight so now work three chains one two three you can cut off this yarn second let me cut that yarn the previous color this and yes now i have got this you can pull it push it inside okay so now yes i have done with three chains and i'll repeat the pattern again so work one double crochet throughout the round so so one double crochet and you will repeat this for three more rows so to do that first you need to chain three and then do one double crochet throughout the round then join the round by slip stitch and repeat that same now i have reached till here so now again i would like to change the color of my yarn so let's slip stitch and pull through now pull the yarn tight and you can cut the yarn later so chain 3 so 1 2 and 3 after chaining 3 we'll repeat the round again one double crochet okay so you will repeat the same throughout the round you can pull it tight here you'll repeat the same throughout the round and you can repeat it as many rows as you want so i have reached till here maybe i need few more rows so let me get back when i reach here now i'm done with my desired length so by the end of the round it looks like this and now you can insert your phone so beautiful phone pouch is ready this pouch can also be used to keep your goggles and be safe you can use it as a goggle pouch or you can use it as a phone pouch as well if you like my video tutorial please do like my video and mention it in the comments below and if you haven't subscribed my channel yet please do consider subscribing my channel in order to get the latest video updates thank you for watching